the Royal Bengal Tiger, the pride of West Bengal and India, considered to be the second largest tiger in the world and the most numerous tiger species in Asia, calls the mighty Sundarbans its home. Fishing is a major livelihood which is mostly done from mid-June to mid-August. Large varieties of fish are available in this region, but the availability of fish has gradually been decreasing during recent years. 25th May 2009 In a private hospital in Kolkata, a few senior doctors while in the OT were stunned by the news broadcast in the middle of an ongoing operation. Cyclone Isla hit Sundarban with all its fury and might. Affected 6 million people, including the death of 115. Damaged 6 lakh houses and hundreds trapped inside. The doctors watched the news of this devastation that hit West Bengal, aghast at the devastation that had cost the lives of so many people. People have been killed in West Bengal for in Kolkata as heavy wind and rain lashed the state after a depression over the way of Bengal intensified into a severe cyclonic storm, Isla. The cyclone which uh, was to have hit Kolkata sectioned towards Howrah, Bukhi and Bonshan towards Howrah, The devastating effects of the cyclone ripped everything in its path, including homes, fields, agriculture, farms, and so many innocent lives with it. Lives were uprooted and destroyed. Nishabd Ongikar Welfare Association, as it was christened, was formed by these group of doctors who decided that they had to do something. Gradually, people from other professions join NAVA as well. The first relief group of NAVA travelled all the way to the Sundarbans, armed with food, relief material, medicines and hope. The doctors helped set up relief camps and provided the victims with all the resources that could help them. Gradually, Nava expanded its footprints, reaching out to more people, touching lives in many new and innovative ways. Free health checkup camps are frequently organized at designated villages where medicines are distributed as well.
Nava has also set up a special scholarship for needy girls to help them realize their dreams of a career. Solar panels are set up at various villages and schools and the people are educated about the benefits they can attain from such advanced methods of solar power harvesting. Toilets are being set up and people are being educated about the importance of healthy sanitary methods. Water purification filters are also being provided to ensure safe water supply to one and all with generators to power them. Computers and libraries are provided to schools for the betterment of education techniques. Needy women are gifted with sewing machines to help them earn a livelihood. Youngsters are encouraged to take part in sports and are provided with the latest in equipment. Nava, in the future, hopes to set up a home for needy senior citizens who need a helping hand. With this, we at Nava make a silent promise. The promise to help when you need it the most. Reach us at www.nava.kolkata.org or visit our Facebook and Twitter pages to know how you can help us make a difference.